the regular season. Just have yourselves in position to be in the playoffs and healthy when you get there. This is a veteran ball club. Kill you down low with dunks and post ups. This is again inside to Williams. Nice spin move baseline. Momentary double team by Williams. They switch. Reed picks up Willis. Kevin turns and scores. He has had a heck of a career. Grand Hill. Nice penetration. The left he goes. Nice little curl off the screen down. Barkley, somebody's got to stop him. Williams finally did. Charles still determined. He puts it down. Oh, big mistake defensively for the Pistons that time. Screen and roll. Hunter and Hill. Crossover against Rhodes. And Grant draws the whistle for the rookie. Running opportunities yet. Barkley against Reed. Leans in with a left hand. That's pretty. Barkley is very good in that post. You almost have to double him. Myers with it to Lindsay, who curled off the screen of Williams. Hunter back to beat up. Six footer. Perfect. His patented jump hook. Back come the Pistons. Nice crossover move. Grant loses Rhodes. Ooh. Went by him. Double coming from Joe D. Rhodes spotting Drexel. Eight footer. Backs it home. Nice pass by Rhodes. I mean, he scissored that thing right through the teeth. He comes off the bench. Do a six man roll right now under Alvin Gentry. Ran in traffic with a nice knife from Jeff. Then explode if your foot is bothering you. Drop up. Blocked by Reed. Willis wanted to dunk it. The Chiefs said, no, sir. Bounce feed to Stackhouse. No bomb. Good. It's a three. Notice. And now some of the reinforcements come in. Not a bad guy coming off your bench right now. <laughs> Hakeem Olajuwon is to defend him. Well, now Houston fashions three of the 50 greatest players in NBA history. They're all on the floor. And had his eyes on it. Montross used the long arm to get there. Here comes Grant. Nobody stopped him. Scoops and scores. Smart. Smart. Get the outlet. Montross defending Olajuwon. So dangerous. Goes baseline. Ran out of space. In traffic, Barkley, he is fine. Stackhouse with a jump. Good. So Jerry very much in rhythm. First against Montross in the mid post. Turns, baseline, tough shot. Oh my. Hey, tough shot, but that's good defense. You know, you're talking about a great player with a bevy of moves from the low post. Good job by Montross. Stackhouse turns the corner. Long scoop. Seven points for Stack already. Wow. Let's watch this. Ran from the top with a jump. Perfect. Okay. See, that right there is freedom. I think you call a play. Really checks in for the first time tonight. Barkley sizes up Grant Long. Spinning baseline. Goes inside for the two hands. Okay, he's lost a step, right? 48% uh -huh. of their points. 60% of the rebound. But Malik Seeley starts the second quarter with a feathery jumper. And again, Jerome Williams starts the second quarter on the floor. Spin move, Elijah Wan. He got tangled up with Brian Williams. Barkley. Back in Jerome Williams down. Takes him inside. Too easy. Charles Barkley. 13 for Charles. Very strong player. Go, go, go. Shows that, you know, strength is just as important in the post as being tall. Stackhouse gets it. To go at young guys like Jerome Williams when they get up in his face. Plus, he takes it as, takes it as an extra challenge when you don't double him. If you try to guard him one on one, then it's going to be a one on one game out on the. Elijah one-on-one -on -one with Williams in the lane, a runner. They're tearing that box up over there, aren't they? Benefit from, from that. Grant continues to be among the top five minutes played at over 40 night. Joe D. Good old time out there. Pistons are challenging Jerome Williams. Guard him, guard him. Barkley puts it down. Hey. So he's in a zone now. He's in a rhythm and, and, and that type of rhythm. Oh, yeah, I'm sure. I think Barkley was yapping at Ricky early. Of course, they were teammates in Philly. Dumars back to back moves. Don Reed's going to come in instead, though. Williams double. Steal. Sealy. Open spaces. There it is. Good variance of the defense that time. Joe D. Over Maloney. Two more. <laughs> Joe is saying, hey, Charles is a savvy veteran, but he's not the only one. Go. 36 all. Sealy with a tough shot. Hand in his face. It didn't matter. Hot hand for the home team. Grand Hill on the post. Second time we've seen him go there tonight. Scores! You know, I know what you're about to say, Brent. I know what you're about to say. Long minutes so far for Charles Barkley. 
Mahorn let Willis back down. Didn't get a travel. What he got was a jump hook from Willis. Well, rebounding position from your team. But he didn't need it. A cutting Grant Law. Good look by Grant Hill. Since enjoying the uh, reserve battle. But it's been the starters who have killed the Pistons. Elijah one adds to that bench Olajuwon. total, though, for Houston. He's got six. Seeley against Willis gave it up. Open jumper from 20. Good. Malik with eight. All four field goal. Ten on the shot clock. Lindsay gave it up nicely to Grand Hill. 16-foot pop. Perfect. Grant is shooting the lights out tonight. He's got 15. Hill against Rhodes and a double team by Willis. Joe D for three. Rebound. Inside. Williams lays it in. BW with eight. Grant. Williams. Nice clever dish to Grant who was fouled right away by Rhodes. He's in this game. Drexler fights the shot up. Good D by Grant. He has really negated Drexler so far tonight. On one of six shooting for just two points. Then he takes it at him the other way. Three. It's now six. Now five. Barkley. Back and down. Too deep. And he draws two white shirts and a foul. I do for uh, Hall of Fame consideration. Lindsay with a launch. He did it for three. I'm off the 24 second shot clock, then going to half court. Bounce speed to Reed behind him, down with a hook, and rolls one. He hit him the shot clock. Williams rolled inside, Reed again. Oh my goodness. You know who set that up? Charles backing down now. No double team help coming yet. Now in traffic. A fall away, but Barkley's just too deep at that point. He's got 20. And three as they go to work. Flip off to Lindsay. Oh, Give and go off the hook hit by Joe D. And Joe was the finals MVP with shots like that. And that to beat the shot clock. Distance by five as Grand Hill goes inside Rhodes. Thought defensive help was coming. Nobody was home. Get a double figure mark, and that'd be a nice psychological advantage as Akeem Olajuwon prepares to check back in. What? Grant finding the horn somehow, and he lays it in. You know what? Let me tell you why that play is smart. Give him the basketball. Give him a chance for an offensive uh, play. Elijah Juan fell out of bounds. He thought he was pulled, but it was the Matador defense by Mohorn. He had that cape up there one more time. Gives Lambeer a wink. Right there. You know, Drexler, you know, even at 39, at least that's what Rick Mahorn says he is, he gets Drexler on him inside. That's a mismatch favoring the horn. Lindsay for three. Eight points. Kumar just sits down to a hand. What Jerry Stackhouse has to do is come in and keep the defensive intensity up that the rest of the guys have on the floor. Grant Long facing up at Barkley. Takes it at him. Block going help out, I believe, by Elijah Warren. Mahorn sticks it. Oh. Lays back. Akeem pretty deep. Kelly for three. Yep. Oh, he's so good at that. Only 20. Stackhouse off the screen. Goes in the middle hard. Mahorn had it knocked away nicely, though, by Drexler. Has won as much as they can, as long as he stays in there. Played 12 first half minutes. The dream shake, and he scores. He can give you every move you could ever think of. Keeps you so off balance as a defender over there. Five on the shot clock. They must hurt. Somebody's got to take it. Mahorn does. It's blocked by Elijah Warren. No foul, down the floor, Barkley ahead of the pack. He is fouled hard by Lindsey Hunter. Charles knows it was just a good aggressive foul. No need for anybody to get their feathers on. It's low, and he went out before break, and uh, they have not had that offensively since. Seeley continues to be perfect from the floor. Didn't get him up off his feet. Seeley with a tough catch, now goes in the teeth of the defense. Hit the shot and a foul! But the Pistons can get it. They'll come back with a chance to go back up double digits. Elijah one. Look at the moves. Oh, oh goodness. Oh, oh, take a picture of that. The footwork. Oh. Drexler against Seal. Takes it in hard. Flips it up and in. Drexler has been very quiet tonight. Just one for six prior to that drive. Points a game. He traps Seeley, goes inside. Off balance and lefty. Oh, where'd that come from? Malik with 14. On. Willis and Elliott front. Akeem over Montrose. Look out if he starts heating up. No double team help coming yet. Elijah one cleverly missed it. And there's a late whistle foul. Positioning against Montrose. Again, no double. Maloney left open. 
Bingo, it's he's, for three. He's got to be the happiest player that Elijah wants back in the line. Could get squared up by the jump hook. This one's again with a chance. Grant spins and scores. Give him 20. 81-81. It's been a great ball game all night long. Mahorn this time called for the pull-down foul on Elijah Wan. I've seen him a hundred times, and he might be the most effective. Ryan Williams pulls up, scores. B.W. Grant from the top. Good. Give him 22. I don't need to tell you how important those jumpers are to his game. Barkley Mahorn says, "Come on, give it to me." Ricky forces him out a little bit. Max Barkley down. Had him down to Williams. Had him off balance. Yes, Did you did. notice? He's two for three tonight with a Matador. 681. It's all a part of the mind game, you know, yep. that Mahorn plays. Joe D. Got it. It's a long two. Timeout. Rudy Tom Jonathan. First news prime time. Barkley against Don Reed, who's back in the ball game. Barkley inside block. Oh, and a foul. Ooh. Oh, that's a tough Ooh. One right Ooh, that was tight. Five point difference. Screen by Long goes inside. Joe finds him late. Joe Dumas on the drop off. Now they'll burn some time, presumably. Unless they can get an easy one. They've got numbers. Joe D for three. Got it. Yeah. They had numbers. No need to pull it out. And able to match their effort with defense. All eyes are on. Spins into a turnover. There it is. Which is difficult at best. Dumars inside of Mahorn. Fake the pass. Missed, but he oh! And had the presence of mind and the quickness. See, what he's providing now is gravy. Anytime Mahorn can give you points along with that defense, you just love it. That's the bonus. Play to just make that first pass in the front court. Dumars left open. For three. 16 for Joe Dean. Pistons have made the huge plays down the stretch. Elijah on. had to fight that one up. Mahorn again with defense. Well, I know who my unsung hero is tonight. The guy that always bothers us while we're trying to open the show. Pistons cough it up. Drexler cleverly to L.A. who was fouled for behind by Grant Long. Detroit can afford to use some clock here. Grant short of the glass. Williams comes it up. This is the most emotion we have seen from Brian Williams. You know, when you talk about the All-Star break coming, even though the Pistons are going to win this game, I think the All-Star break is, is still timely for them because it gives them, you know, the, the ball was going to stop drop, dropping out of that half-court situation for Houston eventually if they just stay true to their defensive concept. Alvin, getting congratulations from everybody on that bench and well-deserved, including a big hug and a big smile. And look at that. That tells you all you need to know about what the Pistons feel about the man who has been moved into the number one 